So when you're doing the Lazy Boy Castaway, before you'll be able to do this move, you have to know how to do a legless backflip. And it helps if you know how to do a castaway. And when you're doing the Lazy Boy Castaway, you want to make sure you have grippy shoes and a grippy wall. And also, the more higher the wall is, the more easier the move is. And the more lower the wall is, the more harder and you have to push more hard. So, first when you're doing the Lazy Boy Castaway, you're laying down and you're bringing your body up. And when you're swinging your arms, you're not just swinging it straight up, you're swinging it a little bit to the side but over your head. So, you're laying down, coming up, swinging your arms, and you're pushing off of this leg. And you're not just depending on the leg alone, you're swinging your arms hard and pushing off of this leg. You're doing a castaway, that means you're moving away from the wall, not landing back here. And um, then after you come up, at this point, it's a backflip. And when you're landing, you want to land on the ball of your feet. And now I will show you one. exercise will help you with your leg muscle for the lazy boy castaway the squat and the pistol now we will show you how to spot this move I put my ins here I'm using the shirt and it's hip and I would make sure that it move away from the wall and land safely. Okay? And make sure it move away from the wall safely. Okay? And then I spot them every time, then I do it a little bit less and a little bit less until it looked like he's doing it safe enough so he's not going to jump the wall. Okay? And also always train smartly and safely. And the first time you're trying this move, you can use a helmet. But make sure the helmet is a light helmet, not too heavy helmet, or it can affect your balance. And also, thank you, and subscribe for more amazing tutorials and videos.